Hello, I'm Sunny, and I'm an international master's student here at Chalmers. I'm in my first year of the program Interaction Design, and I'm currently in the Kugin building, which is the main building where most of my classes are held. So I'm going to try to see if I can catch some of my classmates and get some insight into what the program is really about. I'm Linda. So before I studied industrial design engineering uh, here at Chalmers. Isaac. My background is in uh, software engineering. Anton, uh, cognitive science. Sven Gertsen, in information studies, which is a kind of like a broad bachelor where you can choose different specializations. And I chose interaction design as my specialization. It's Emmanuel, um, interaction design, master's, second year. Cognitive science during my bachelor. Previously I've worked in various different fields, so everything from service homes to uh, manufacturing and so on. Well, I like the digital aspect of it and it uh, has a great future potential, I think. Because I, whereas I like programming and the software part, I tend to gravitate to the interaction with people instead of more nitty-gritty code stuff. Uh, I wanted to work with uh, people from different backgrounds in very like practical pro projects. So mostly it was because I'm very interested in user behavior and cognition. Um, and I'm also inter interested in the graphical aspects as well, like creating prototypes and designing. And the kind of combination of those two worlds, so combining my bachelor with something that I'm also very interested in, which is design. How practical it is from what I've been doing before. I like how up to date it is. It is really like challenging and uh, looking at the trends that is uh, coming. So yeah. I feel I'm going to be very fresh when I come out. Um, both that it seems to be a lot of group work, like working in teams and stuff, as well as uh, the hands on stuff. You really get down and dirty, basically. So here, specifically in Shelmas, the teachers are all specialists in each area and you can really feel that when they are teaching you or when they have these projects that they support us in and then i feel like interaction design is the perfect field between technology and design and i like that the first year gave me like a really broad foundation of methods and also a really broad foundation of kind of principles or design patterns for example to to, to try mm -hmm. uh, which is a um, been really good because now I have formed my foundation of what I think is productive for me and what is productive for the group I'm working with. It's great. <laughs> uh, I learn a lot like every, every day since it's uh, like a combination of different fields and people have a lot of different views so it's a good combination. I think it's awesome. I believe I'm gonna work with people from other countries uh, later too so it's a good, good thing to start off with here. The differences between all those different people's backgrounds really help the projects to be elevated to another level. Because someone might be really good at programming, someone might be really good at the graphical stuff. And then you have someone like me who's kind of like a mix of everything. And I really got to learn a lot from that. So for me, having a Bachelor in Cognitive Science, I usually have like a great or like a wide perspective of behavior or how users make decisions and how they think. And and those things but what I'm lacking is the kind of design aspect so I'm not very good at for example designing things from the bottom up and it, it's very noticeable when we have group projects that we all have these different strengths and we can all provide them in a in a kind of productive manner so to speak which is really cool well thank you so much for your time today thank you thank you oh that's awesome yeah. all right thank you